Hey there guys and welcome back. So now that we know what UI and UX means and what it stands for, we're going to understand what Adobe XD is. Now Adobe XD is an application that was released by Adobe in March 2016. And uh, at the time of this recording of this video, it's more than a year and Adobe XD has come a long way since their initial release. Now first of all, what does XD stand for? XD stands for Experience Design, so it's basically called Adobe Experience Design. It's a pretty cool name. So what can I do with Adobe XD, if you ask? Well, I would say Adobe XD is an application that is used to create UI and UX designs. That's it. It's pretty simple, no complicated. Now, if you don't know what you would expect from a software like this, there is an application called a Sketch that is available for Mac. So if you've heard of it, it's similar to that. If you haven't heard of it, it's no biggie. And that's what you can do with Adobe XD. But what can't you do with Adobe XD? You cannot create an application, you cannot code, you cannot develop. You can only design it so that it can be used by developers to actually code application, software or the website. So now let's talk about the system requirements for Adobe XD. Now Adobe XD runs on the Mac as well as the Windows. Now for Mac, you're going to need version 10.10 .10 or later. That is the most basic requirement. Now there are also other advanced system requirements uh, which if you would like to know I'll put a link down below in the description where you can go and check out all the system requirements and see if your system is compatible. Now coming to Windows, you're gonna need Windows 10 right off the bat. Now Windows 10 has to be version 1607. Now if you don't know which version of Windows you're running, all you gotta do is click on your start button search for search for about your pc and in the version you're gonna see which version you're running so those are the most basic system requirements needed for adobe xd now how do you download adobe xd so all you gotta do is download the creator cloud application onto your desktop install it and then go to the application section and you're gonna find adobe xd sitting right over there and just click on install and it's gonna install it for you now it's going to obviously install the latest version but what I want to mention is Adobe XD team has a practice of releasing monthly updates so what they do is they take the feedback from the users every month and incorporate all those into the next monthly update so if you're watching this video probably at a later stage after a couple of months there are going to be a lot of changes in Adobe XD so what I want to do is for every month when they release a new update after this course, I'm going to go and record a separate video and upload it on the channel so you guys can check out all those updated features to Adobe XD and also learn everything about Adobe XD in this course. And I'm going to link that down below in the description so you guys can see all the monthly updates in case you're watching this course a little late. So the current version I'm running is 0.6.34.3 beta. So if your version is a little bit higher, then obviously you have to go down below in the description and see the new updates to Adobe XD and you can continue watching this course. So now it's time to jump into the course and work on it hands-on and start creating some amazing stuff. So I'll see you guys in my next video.